Welcome to today's video. Today, I am bringing you all of my Colleen Rothschild skincare recommendations and a few new products in observation of their Reap Your Reward sale that is currently happening right now through uh, Sunday the 28th. This video is in partnership and sponsored by Colleen Rothschild. You guys know I'm a big fan of this brand. Um, I have actually been raving about their products for 10 months before I even ever worked with them. I'm a huge fan of Colleen Rothschild. So whenever I have the opportunity to work with them, I'm always, it's just always a no brainer for me. So um, you guys have heard me talk about a lot of these products in videos over the last year. So the ones that I feel like I've just talked about so much, I'm gonna kind of breeze through those a little quickly, but I do stick around to the end because I do have a few new products. Some of them that I've tried over the last week and I'm gonna give you my thoughts up until now. And then some I have not tried yet, but I picked up at the Reward Style Conference. So, so a little information on the sale. This sale I love because uh, their entire line is on sale essentially. Basically the more you spend, the more you save and it affects all products on the line. So sometimes they have products specifically for like their best sellers or sometimes they have certain products that are on sale but not others. This sale affects their entire line. So if there has ever been a time to try Colleen Rothschild, definitely this sale is one of them. If you are currently on their skincare and you love it, it's a good time to stock up on it. The way that it works is if you spend $100, you get $25 off your order. If you spend $200, you get $50 off your order. And if you spend $300, you get $75 off your order. So it's a really great deal. I'll have all the information, the links, the promo codes, all that good stuff down below. All right, let's get started. Okay, let's dive right in. First, we're gonna start, and I'm gonna move through this quickly because I know you've heard me talk about this a million times. It's the cleansing balm. Um, I love this, you guys. I've been using this for about a year. I picked this up at the first Reward Style Conference a year ago, and I used it, I, I mean, I've, I've used it this entire time. Um, it is probably my most used cleanser. I definitely have tried other cleansers and I've liked other types of cleansers, but this is the one that I've used the most. It's a solid balm cleanser, which I really like that consistency. The smell smells like a spa. It's the best way to describe it. It smells so, so good, like such a treatment. Um, I apply this on dry skin, uh, so do not wet your skin. You want this to be dry. I massage it in. I actually take off my eye makeup with it. And then you take their muslin cloth, which I think I have one up here. Oh, I think I might've left it downstairs. It's a cloth that comes with a cleanser when you purchase it. Submerge that in warm water, squeeze it out, and just remove everything. And it gets all of my makeup off and my skin doesn't feel stripped or taut or dry. It feels very, very hydrated. Um, almost sometimes to where I actually forget to put moisturizer on because my skin feels so, so good. So I always recommend this product for people that are haven't tried any of her products and wanna know if I got if I were to get one thing, what should I get? I always say you just cannot go wrong with this. Of course, if you don't like a balm cleanser, then Perhaps not, but uh, if you like this type of texture, this is something I highly recommend. Now she has two moisturizers and I've used them both and I like them both and they're very, very different. She has the Sheer Renewal Cream, but this is actually a travel size. It actually comes in about this size when you purchase it. So this is a really interesting product because it's a lightweight lotion, but what's what makes this product really interesting is that it actually dries to like a powder-like finish. So if you have oily skin, you can't really see anything, but it's very, very lightweight and sheer. You rub it in and it um, absorbs into the skin quickly and it sets to like a powder-like finish. Um, I've never tried a moisturizer like that before. Uh, so oily skin types, you would love this. Uh, if you uh, are someone that is kind of in a rush in the morning and you apply your makeup pretty quickly after applying your moisturizer, you would probably like this as well because again, it's just gonna prep your skin and be ready for makeup pretty immediately. Uh, it's a really, really interesting product. So I do like this one, except when I'm a little bit more dry, I gravitate towards the Extreme Recovery Cream. This comes in a jar and uh, a very, very different in con consistency. It's it's kind of an interesting cream. Like it's 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 not just like a thick cream. There's there's more kind of like almost like a cream and a mousse is what this reminds me of. This consistency and this feels so nice. So I use this at night. Uh, however, I was using this a little bit in the drier months when my skin was really dry. I would use this in the morning as well. Neither one have SPF, so you are gonna want want to follow up with an SPF after applying these if you apply them in the morning. Um, this has a really nice, clean, refreshing smell to it as well. But if you like a thicker, richer moisturizer, I recommend the Extreme Recovery Cream, but it's not so thick in the sense that it's heavy and you can't wear it under makeup. It's just something that you would want to allow your skin a little bit more time before going in with your uh, makeup right after it. But I have worn this daytime too. Okay, moving right along. I feel like this is the my other highly most talked about Colleen Rothschild product. And yes, 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 it's the face oil number nine. I love, 
love this stuff. It is so nice. I look forward to applying this every single night. My husband uses it too, so we have kind of increased our consumption of this product by two. Um, it's just a beautiful face oil. I love the consistency. It's not too thick and sticky. It's not a dry oil either, so it actually feels luxurious. It feels like it's moisturizing and hydrating the skin, but it doesn't feel heavy. I can also mix this with makeup, which makes it really versatile and a really nice product to have in your arsenal. So that's kind of the consistency of it. You can see that it does it is sliding down my hand, but it's not like, oh, it just feels so good. It feels so good. I love this oil. It too has a nice, um, all of her products have a really nice scent to me. They're just very spa-like is what it smells like. It it reminds me of getting a facial in a spa. That's what her products remind me of. So I have two more products to talk about that I uh, love, and then I have a few new products that I'm really excited to talk about. Uh, so the Clarifying Detox Mask, this is a small travel size. It comes in about this size here. Um, this is such a great mask for really pulling up all those impurities in your skin, getting rid of dirt and oil, making your skin feel squeaky clean. If you like a squeaky clean, taut feeling to your skin, this is a product for you because that's exactly what it's gonna do. You put it on your face, you let it sit for 10 or 15 minutes till it dries, you wipe it off and your skin has never felt so clean. I promise you, it is so amazing. I need to be using this more often. When I first got on it last year, I was using it two or three times a week and now it's kind of more like once every couple of weeks. But every time I do this, uh, my skin just looks bright. And I think that this could also help with the reduction of pore size that I've been complaining about too. So I'm gonna start, I commit to you guys today that I'm gonna start using this in my routine more time and just take the time to kind of treat um, my enlarged pores that I've had lately. And her complete eye cream, I always recommend her eye cream to people who are asking for a good kind of day and night eye cream just because I love the consistency of it. It's thick and rich, so it's a rich enough for me at night but it also absorbs into the skin in a way that allows me to apply concealer shortly after. I do give it maybe three or four minutes, uh, but my concealer works well on top of it. So I really love this eye cream. It's definitely my most used eye cream over the last 12 months. Um, I can only think of maybe one or two other eye products that I've tried, one being her retinol eye oil, um, and then another eye cream that has kind of uh, supplemented when I was out of this. Okay, let's talk about a couple of new products. Uh, a couple of them I've used and one I have not used yet, but the Intense Hydrating Mask. So I got this at the Reward Style Conference a week ago and I saw another influencer raving about it. She's one of my favorite influencers to follow. She was raving about this. She, and I know she travels a lot, so I know that her skin is always just kind of going through the ringer. And she says that she this makes such a difference on her skin. So I've used this twice. It uh, it says mask, but when you apply it, it's more it looks more like a lotion. Um, I mean, this is what it looks like. It looks more like a lotion moisturizer. So I applied a really thick layer on my skin as it's described to do, um, and it says to leave it on your skin for 10 or 15 minutes. I found, and then it also says you can leave it on all night long, so you don't have to remove it with a cloth. Um, when I went to remove it with a cloth, it had probably been 20 minutes or so, so that's what kind of what it looks like when it's on the hand as a, or when it's on the skin as a mask. When I went to remove it about 20 minutes later, I found that it had pretty much absorbed into my skin, like my skin was craving that hydration. So I actually did not end up removing it and it felt so incredible. I didn't even apply another moisturizer that night. This was kind of um, in place of my moisturizer. So I'm excited to continue to use this and incorporate this in my routine. It's basically like a really intense moisturizer. Okay, so the next products I'm so excited to share with you guys because it's a new category for Colleen Rothschild. It's hair care. When we were at the conference, they kind of just like unveiled this new hair care product that launched that same week. Um, there's actually two products that they launched, the Quench and Shine, Quench and Shine Restorative Mask, and then they also launched the Smooth and Shine Hair Serum. So currently, they're selling the two together as a set for $34, you guys. It's on sale, um, I believe, now through the end of the month. So that's a really, really great deal for these two products, especially a, a mask this size. I've actually used this twice now, and three times. I've used this three times now. And when it comes to skincare and hair care products, I'm kind of um, hesitant to like give a review after one use or two use because I find that Rarely do you find a skin or a hair care product that I feel like you can see the results or the benefits that quickly. Um, so when I got on Instagram and I was sharing this the first night that I used this, I was kind of cautious about any claims that I was going to make. But now having used it a couple of times, I feel more comfortable and confident speaking to this. So first of all, when you open it, it is a pretty thick lotion. It's not like a balm or anything. It's a really kind of rich, not lotion, it's a really rich cream. It smells 
so good. It smells incredible. So when I use a mask like this, and there was another, there were other masks that I use. I actually have been using a hair mask in my routine for years, and I use it about once a week. So I apply this the same as I had been applying that, which is take about, I don't know, a little more than a quarter size amount for me because I have a lot of hair. And I uh, apply it basically from like here down, and I really just work it into the ends of my hair. Uh, my hair is pretty processed. I get highlights every six weeks. I get keratin treatments. I blow dry it all the time. It's pretty dry. So I really focus it there. And then it also comes with a little brush that Brooklyn has uh, snagged from me. I don't know where that is, but it's a cute little pink brush. And I, I ran it through um, my hair that night. I stood in the shower for, I don't know, three or four minutes, not a really long time, just a few minutes. And then I kind of ran my fingers through it and my hair felt like silk. It felt so, and of course, and keep in mind it's soaking wet, but it felt, I could tell a difference in the way that my hair felt from using just a regular conditioner. Rinsed it out, dried my hair. Um, before I dried my hair, I should say, I actually applied a little bit of the shine serum first in the same thing. I applied it from here down to the ends. I really avoid my roots because I don't want, I try and get away with washing my hair as a little as possible, so I try and avoid putting product here. And uh, I put this on wet hair, I blow dried my hair out, and then I put a little bit of this um, on dry hair at just kind of right here, like on the lower third of my hair, just to really make those, those ends shiny because they tend to look a little dry. And I was really impressed. Even after one use, I noticed a difference not necessarily in the way my hair looked because I have always been taking good care of my hair. Um, and I think that it looked the same, but it felt softer. And I actually used it this morning. Um, I washed my hair this morning. And if there is a softness to my hair that is new to me, my hair does not normally feel this way. So I am a fan of these two products. And I think for the price, it's a fantastic, fantastic buy. And the last product that I picked up is the Vitamin C Treatment Complex. So I've been using Vitamin C for about a year and a half, two years now. Um, and what I use is more of like a liquidy water type serum. This is actually kind of like a, a lotion, but when you rub it into the skin, it really emulsifies almost like a liquid. Um, now I haven't used this yet, so I'm gonna be, um, I'm gonna be testing this one out and trying it, but uh, it's different than the current product I use, but I highly believe in using a vitamin C serum because once I started using a vitamin C serum two years ago, like I noticed this, an improvement in my skin and then I just continued to use it. So I kind of didn't really notice a change, but when I stopped using it, that's when I noticed a change. I got off of it and I was like, oh, I don't need to replenish that right away. And a month went by, two months went by and I looked in the mirror and I'm like, yeah, that, that stuff does work. <laughs> so if you're not using a vitamin C uh, product in your routine, um, I definitely recommend getting started on one. All right, you guys, that wraps up my recommendations and I wanted to share those new products with you as well. Feel free to leave all your questions and comments in the comment section below and I'm happy to answer them for you. So I'll have promo code and links and all of that for all of these products in the description box below. I do wanna thank Colleen Rothschild for sponsoring this video and I wanna thank you guys for watching it. As always, I hope you guys have a fantastic day and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.